Hello students, welcome back. Let's take up another question which is from class 10 NCRT science textbook and the question is example 12.6 of electricity chapter. The question reads, a wire of given material having length L and area of cross section A has a resistance of 4 ohm. What would be the resistance of another wire of the same material having length L by 2 and the area of cross section 2A? So, let's understand this question first. We have a wire made up of a certain material and the length of the wire is L and its area of cross section is A. Now, we have another wire of the same material but the length of the second wire is L by 2 that is half of the previous wire and the area of cross section of the new wire is double that of the previous wire. So, now we have to find out how would the resistance of this wire change when its length is halved and area of cross section is doubled. So, let's write down. So, now here are the two wires. Now, the length of the first wire is L and its area of cross section is A. Now, the second wire which is made up of the same material has a length half of the previous one that is the new length is L by 2 of the original one but the new area of the second wire is A dash is 2A that is the new area is double of that of the previous wire. Now the resistivity for both the wires remains the same because resistivity depends upon the nature of material and the nature of material in both the wires remains the same. So, the resistivity remains the same. Now, let us find out how would the resistance change. Now, the resistance of this wire R is given as let us say R1. R1 is given as 4 ohm. Alright. Now, the formula for the resistance is given by R1 is equal to rho L by A and this value is given as 4 ohm. Ohm, that is the resistance of this wire of length L and area of cross section A is 4 ohm. Now, let us see what is the resistance of the new wire. Now, R2 that is the resistance of the new wire is rho. Now, since rho remains the same that is the resistivity for both the wires is same. So, I write here rho L is L dash by A is also A dash because these are L dash and A dash are the new length and the new area of cross section. Now, what is L dash? Now, L dash is L by 2 that is half of the previous value and A dash is the new area which is twice of that of the original value. So, here we get rho L by 2 into 2 A. So, that will be rho L by 4 a. Now, taking this 4 out, it is 1 by 4 rho L by a. Alright. So, let us put this in the bracket. Now, what is rho L by a? So, here rho L by a is nothing but R1 that is the resistance of the original wire. So, I write here it is 1 by 4 R1. Hence, we got R2 is 1 by 4 R1 that is the new resistance will be one fourth of the original resistance. But here we have our original resistance value given that is 4 ohm. Now substituting the value of R1 in this equation we get it 1 by 4 into R1 is 4. So 4 4 cancels it is 1. Hence we write R2 is 1 ohm. So the value of resistance of the new wire is one fourth of the original one and since the value of the original resistance is 4 ohm, so it is 1 by 4 is 1 ohm. So, the resistance of the new wire is 1 ohm. So, this is the solution to this question. So, I hope you have understood the solution. So, with that we come to the end of this video. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Please watch the playlist containing the solved physics questions and numericals from the previous year's board exams. I have shared the link of the playlist in the description box. It will be very helpful to you while preparing for your exams.